Hey right, guys, so we're told that the world is overpopulated, but that is just an illusion. You know, we're told that the world's overpopulated. We're told that the UK, for example, is very a very overpopulated island. We're told that England is overpopulated, right? So, if we look at London, and the area in the N25, which is has a population of about 8 million, maybe even slightly more now, maybe 9 million. Uh, and I think the commuter belt around it has about 12 million, so places around it. Right? So, if we times this area of London by 10 that would give us 80 million there's 66 million people living in the united kingdom there's about 50 over 50 million living in england so if we times this area by 10 that would be 80 million people right so let's times this area so if we take this area and put it here that's one area there so that's one two lots of london three lots of london four lots of london five lots of london Six lots of London, seven lots of London, eight lots of London, nine lots of London, ten lots of London. So we could fit easily 80 million people in the UK with a lot of space, a lot of space left, right? Overpopulation is an illusion, like I said. We could probably fit ten Londons in the south of England. We could fit 80 million in the south of England and still have all this, all the Midlands and the north of England left, along with Scotland and Wales as well, right? So all these these grey areas are urban areas where people live, houses, right? All the green is all the countryside and the little villages. Look how much green there is in comparison to the to the so-called cities, which is the grey area. So we've got the grey areas, which is the urban areas, and obviously the green areas, which is the countryside. All the green is the countryside. All the grey is where everyone lives. Look at how much space there is in comparison. A lot more space. A lot, an awful lot more space. Right? Than cities. You know, in comparison, if we look at it as a whole... Look at all the grey. There's barely any grey, is there? And the, the grey represents big cities and big urban areas where everyone lives. But there's an awful lot of ple uh, green, which is the countryside, isn't there? A lot more land. Yeah, an awful lot more land. So we could spread big cities out in the UK. We've got enough farmland to grow food as well. It's bullshit that when they talk about we don't have enough. It gives us the illusion that we're overpopulated because most of us live in cities and it's crammed and densely densed and very busy. So it looks like it gives the illusion that it's overpopulated. And that can be anywhere in the world. For example, the Netherlands. That's a very supposedly overpopulated country, even more densely populated than the UK. So again, we've got all the grey areas, which are the urban areas. We've got all the green around it. Much more green. Much more land. So cut another one. Let's go to India. Let's uh, do a big city. Let's do uh, New Delhi, which is a very big city. One of the biggest uh, metropolitan areas in the world. Millions of people live here. Well, probably up to about 20 million. So we've got a like, massive, massive city. And, um, you know, people will think it's overpopulated or India's overpopulated because most of them live in dense cities and are crammed into these very small streets and buildings, these shanty towns in small areas. But if you look at a whole of New Delhi, right, that's New Delhi. Look at all the space and all the countryside around it. Some of it's mountains, but a lot of it you could do farmland on, right? You could spread millions of people across india of how big it is it's massive but they want everyone living in dense cities everyone moves to the cities because that's where all the jobs are supposedly that's how they have more control 
Right, look at all the green. All this yellow stuff, I guess, is probably high mountain areas, but it's not cities. All the grey around there are the big cities, look. See the difference? You've got the pink here and the grey. The grey is the urban area. I'm guessing the pink is probably mountainous. There's barely any grey. Look at all the green there is in India. Overpopulation is an illusion. They want you know they want you to think the world's overpopulated. Because, so when they show big cities in India uh, that are very dense, everyone's living in very compact areas. Uh, look, very compact streets. But then, come out of the big cities, which is only a very small area in comparison to how much countryside there is. Look how much land there is. Look how spaced out it is around the big, big, big cities. Very spaced out. Very, very spaced out. <clears throat> so yeah, overpopulation is an illusion. I want you to think the world's overpopulated. Because uh, that, that, that's what they want. They want to kill people off for their own perverse, disgusting gain. But it's not. It's just an illusion. And they talk about there's not enough money in the world, right? There's not enough money in the world. There's not enough money in Africa, right? Have you ever thought about this? The people, the Rothschild, the Rockefeller, or however how far it goes up, the Bilderberg Group, or, and all the people, the banks that print the money, can print as much money as they want. They can produce as much currency as they want and, and spread it throughout the world, right? But they choose not to. Because otherwise their system would not work, and they want their system to work. And the only way for their system to work is have massive inequality, massive loads of poverty. And that's how they thrive. It's disgusting and it's sick and the system needs to go. Right, thanks guys and I'll look forward to making the next video.